Hi guys and welcome back to Phil's Drone Zone and in this quick tutorial I'm just going to go through something that happened to me quite recently. Um, I had an issue with Final Cut Pro and importing um, media and it is something that is um, quite easy to solve. There are two, two issues basically. One, I created it myself and two, it's very simple to solve. Now, when you go to import data um, what happened to me was that subfolders were missing and I just got hundreds and hundreds of files um, and imagine how frustrating that will be trying to import files and you don't quite know which file it is. So um, I did a lot of research and um, there is a very simple solution to this and I did create the problem myself. Okay, so when this happens to you, here's what you need to do. Okay, so you need to um, shut down Final Cut Pro. So once on the desktop, um, the problem that had, that had occurred was I wanted to format the um, camera, my camera um, card. So instead of going through the files and looking for um, which ones I'd already saved, I just copied the complete DCIM folder over onto the desktop. This is the problem. Now Final Cut Pro is seeing that folder and treating my entire desktop as a camera card. So the solution to this is very, very simple. All you have to do is rename the folder. I'll just call this one uh, camera card. So once it's renamed, um, then all you have to do, open up Final Cut Pro again. And once you've opened up Final Cut Pro, you'll be back at your project. And if you click now, click on the import you'll see that all your subfolders are back. And uh, that solves the problem. So don't despair if it happens to you. The solution is very simple. Okay, so it's as simple as that. And um, if you are um, currently suffering this problem, I hope that this has been able to help you out. Um, and if it does happen to you in the future, then you'll certainly know what to do about it now. Okay, hopefully that has solved a problem for some of you or will be useful um, should you encounter this problem in the future. I'll be back in the next couple of days with a more normal video. So all that remains to be said is see you in the next video.